We have team coverage as we track COVID-19 across the region. As health officials try to slow the spread of the virus and get people vaccinated, researchers want to predict how long this Omicron variant surge could last. Alex Littlehale shows us what they've uncovered. Flipping the calendar year to 2022 won't leave behind this pandemic. Virginia added a record breaking 12,000 new infections Wednesday and researchers say those numbers could climb even higher in the next year. Of course, we're seeing Omicron breaking through some of that that uh, previous uh, protection that we had, the antibody uh, that we had in terms of cases. Um, so there are a lot more susceptibles. Let's look at the week before February 13th. This is when a forecasting model produced by the Virginia Department of Health and the University of Virginia predicts the Omicron variant surge will peak. The model's current projection predicts as many as 17,000 cases per day. We're not quite sure how high the peak will be, but we know it's going to be high uh, with cases. Justin Crow works for the VDH Office of Health Equity and says these models aren't exact. The dates and numbers are still predictions. But right now, the Omicron variant's higher transmission rate has outpaced even what the models expected. The UVA team took a conservative approach. They didn't want to take uh, the extreme end either way, uh, but they did use a, a conservative approach to cases. And Omicron does appear to be moving faster than that conservative. Uh, projection that they created. At the moment, health officials say it's unclear when exactly hospitalizations will peak, but say they're expecting similar numbers to that of the previous Delta surge. In Norfolk, I'm Alex Little-Hales for 13 News Now. COVID-19 vaccine numbers and transmission rates could affect those models.